This episode is brought to you by Vital Farms. Isn't it bullshit to have to question where your food comes from? At Vital Farms, you can trace your pasture-raised eggs all the way back to the source, the pasture. On the side of each pasture-raised carton of eggs, you'll find the name of the farm where your eggs were laid. And when you look the farm up on their website, you'll get a peek at all the sunshine, fresh air, and open space the hens enjoy. Learn more and find out where to buy them at vitalfarms.com. Vital Farms, keeping it bullshit free. This episode is brought to you by Kia's first three-row all-electric SUV, the Kia EV9, with available all-wheel drive and seating for up to seven adults, with a zero to 60 speed that thrills you one minute, and available reclining lounge seats that unwind you the next. Visit kia.com slash EV9 to learn more. Ask your Kia dealer for availability. No system, no matter how advanced, can compensate for all driver error and or driving conditions. Always drive safely. This episode is brought to you by Shopify. That's the sound of switching your business to Shopify, the global commerce platform that supercharges your selling. Harness the best converting checkout and same intuitive features, trusted apps, and powerful analytics used by the world's leading brands. Stop leaving sales on the table. Discover why millions trust Shopify to build, grow, and run their business. Sign up today for your $1 per month trial period at shopify.com slash tech23. Welcome to the Human Capital Innovations Podcast, where your source for personal, professional, and organizational growth and development, where we share original research, explore industry trends, and interview executives and thought leaders from across the globe. We hope you join us often for practitioner-oriented content around all things related to leadership, HR, talent management, organizational development, and change management. Maximize your personal and organizational potential with Human Capital Innovations Podcast. Do you enjoy the Human Capital Innovations Podcast? Enjoy ad-free listening by going to the Patreon page, and please consider contributing even at the producer or sponsorship level. And please leave a review. Thank you for your support. Welcome to the Human Capital Innovations Podcast. In this HCI podcast episode, my AI-assisted Charlotte shares my recent Human Capital Leadership article, Navigating Remote Work Challenges, Strategies for Creating a Productive and Engaged Remote Workforce. Navigating Remote Work Challenges Strategies for Creating a Productive and Engaged Remote Workforce The latest American Time Use survey from the Bureau of Labor Statistics has revealed that people who worked in the office daily worked 2.5 hours more per day than those who worked from home on a full-time basis. This has led some to argue that a return to the office could lead to increased economic gains. While the study's findings may be surprising, it's important to keep in mind that remote work has its unique set of challenges that need to be addressed. In this article, I will explore the factors that impact productivity in remote work environments and provide specific examples of how organizations can overcome them to create a productive remote work culture. The challenges of remote work. One of the biggest challenges of remote work is managing distractions. Working from home can blur the lines between work and personal life, making it difficult to stay focused on work tasks. To combat this, organizations can provide employees with tools to manage their time effectively, such as time tracking apps and task management software. They can also encourage employees to set clear boundaries between work and personal life by creating designated workspaces and setting specific work hours. Another challenge of remote work is maintaining a sense of connection with colleagues. Remote workers may feel isolated and disconnected from the organization's culture and goals. To address this, organizations can leverage technology to create virtual team building activities and encourage online communication. They can also provide opportunities for remote workers to attend in person company events and meetings to foster a sense of community. In addition to these challenges, remote work can also impact employee development and career growth. Without the opportunity for face-to-face interaction with managers and colleagues, remote workers may struggle to receive feedback and mentoring. To overcome this, organizations can provide regular virtual one-on-one meetings with managers and encourage peer-to-peer feedback and coaching. Furthermore, remote work can also create challenges in terms of communication. 
remote workers may feel left out of important conversations or may not receive timely responses to their emails and messages. To address this, organizations can establish clear communication protocols and encourage all team members to follow them. They can also create a culture of transparency and open communication to ensure that remote workers feel included in important discussions. How leaders can increase remote worker productivity. I believe that leaders play a critical role in increasing remote work productivity. Here are some ways leaders can increase remote work productivity. Set clear expectations. Leaders should set clear expectations for remote workers and ensure that they understand their goals and objectives. This can help remote workers stay focused and motivated. Provide the right tools. Leaders should provide remote workers with the right tools and technology to do their jobs effectively. This can include video conferencing software, task management tools, and other productivity tools. Establish communication protocols. Leaders should establish clear communication protocols and ensure that all team members follow them. This can help remote workers stay connected and informed. Encourage collaboration. Leaders should encourage collaboration among remote workers and provide opportunities for them to work together on projects. This can help remote workers feel more connected to the organization and improve overall productivity. Provide support and resources. Leaders should provide remote workers with the support and resources they need to be successful. This can include training, coaching, and mentoring to help remote workers develop their skills and grow in their careers. By taking these steps, leaders can create a culture of productivity and engagement among remote workers. This, in turn, can help organizations achieve their goals and objectives and continue to thrive in a remote work environment. Examples of virtual team building activities. Virtual team building activities are essential for creating a sense of connection and community among remote workers. Here are some examples of virtual team building activities that organizations can consider. Virtual trivia. Organize a virtual trivia game where employees can compete against each other and test their knowledge on a variety of topics. Virtual coffee breaks. Create a virtual coffee break where colleagues can come together and chat about non-work related topics over a cup of coffee or tea. Virtual book clubs. Start a virtual book club where employees can read and discuss books related to their industry or personal interests. Online games. Host online games like chess, Scrabble, or other board games that can be played virtually. Virtual fitness challenges. Encourage employees to participate in virtual fitness challenges like step challenges or yoga classes to promote health and wellness. Virtual volunteer opportunities. Organize virtual volunteer opportunities where employees can come together to support a cause they care about. Virtual happy hours. Host virtual happy hours where employees can unwind and socialize over a drink or two. These are just a few examples of virtual team building activities that organizations can consider. The key is to find activities that align with the organization's culture and values and that employees will enjoy participating in. By creating a culture of connection and community, organizations can help remote workers feel more engaged and motivated to do their best work. Ensuring all team members feel included in remote activities. Inclusivity is key when it comes to virtual team building activities. Here are some ways organizations can ensure that all team members feel included. Schedule activities at convenient times. Ensure that team building activities are scheduled at times that are convenient for all team members, regardless of their time zone or work schedule. Use inclusive language. Use inclusive language in all communications related to team building activities. Avoid using language that could be interpreted as discriminatory or exclusionary. Encourage participation. Encourage all team members to participate in the activities, but make sure that participation is voluntary and not mandatory. Leverage technology. Use technology to create a level playing field for all team members. For example, use video conferencing software that allows all team members to see and hear each other. Consider cultural differences. Be mindful of cultural differences when planning team building activities. Activities that may be acceptable in one culture may not be acceptable in another. By taking these steps, Organizations can create a culture of inclusivity and ensure that all team members feel included in virtual team building activities. This, in turn, can help to foster a sense of connection and community among remote workers and improve overall productivity and engagement. Conclusion To conclude, remote work productivity has become a hot topic in recent times, and as HR and leadership consultants, it's our responsibility to provide guidance on how to address the unique challenges of remote work. By managing distractions, maintaining a sense of connection, providing opportunities for development and career growth, establishing clear communication protocols, and creating a culture of productivity and engagement, organizations can create a productive remote work culture that benefits both employees and the organization as a whole. As leaders, 
it's our responsibility to set clear expectations, provide the right tools, establish communication protocols, encourage collaboration, and provide support and resources to help remote workers be successful. With the right approach, remote work can be a powerful tool for organizations to achieve their goals and thrive in today's fast-paced and ever-changing business environment. Do you enjoy the Human Capital Innovations Podcast? Enjoy ad-free listening by going to the Patreon page, and please consider contributing even at the producer or sponsorship level. And please leave a review. Thank you for your support. Thanks again for joining us for this episode of the Human Capital Innovations Podcast. I hope you stay healthy and safe and that you have a great week.